Thelonious C. Jones here with another episode of Black Real Estate Investors and Developers. Today we're highlighting Mr. Mo Vaughn of the Omni Real Estate Group. The goal of these presentations is to present to you individuals that are, of course, black, but are operating, owning, managing real estate in excess of $100 million. My goal is to present to you the big heavyweights in the game that you don't see all over TV posing in front of their Lamborghinis, Ferraris, Bentleys, because uh, they're really out here, like you can see right here, in the street making transactions happen okay so um this is for if you're into the you know the flashy dashy type guys this presentation is probably not for you but if you're into the individual that's really doing big big real big i mean omni new york has done well over a billion dollars in transactions okay it owns and manages well over I think it's anywhere from seven to twelve thousand units. So if you want to deal with people that's really making major plays, you're in the right place. If you're into individuals that's looking like they're making major plays, then you're in the wrong place. I hope that makes sense. Let's move forward. I want to help you guys out. Sorry it's been so long since I've had an episode of this, but hey man, I'm busy. Get with it. Theloniancjones.com. Move on. Let's move forward. Hey, hey, move on. Maurice Samuel Vaughn, this is the man. Here you go. Obviously, he was a baseball player. Played for, what is that, 11 years? 12 years, excuse me, 91 to 2003. He played for the Boston Red Sox, the New York Mets, and the Anaheim Angels. He's originally from Norwalk, Connecticut. Um, also, Mo Vaughn is operating a trucking business right now. And as you can see, this is one of his baseball cards from the 90s when he was playing with the Boston Red Sox. So that's a little bit about Mo Vaughn's history. If you don't know, check him up. Um, he, ha he, he was well known in the league during his reign of 12 years from 91 to 2003. I do remember him as a kid growing up. So let's move forward. Let's talk about Omni New York. This is his company, Omni New York. It focuses on revitalization and development of major apartments. Most of, uh, I would say almost all of these apartments are affordable housing. That's their main niche. Um, Omni New York has rehabbed and developed over 7,000 units in New York City, and I believe New York State also. But based on the reading and research I did, it looks like they currently own and manage 12,000 units, but they've rehabbed and developed 7,000. So obviously they have some experience doing this. So, uh, you, you know, I would research them if I was you. Soak up some game for some, some big dogs that's been doing it for a minute here. Omni New York, they have gone green in most of all their complexes. Um, basically, they're, they're trying to be more energy efficient, trying to leave less of a carbon footprint um, when they do in their renovation. So they're taking a lot out a lot of the old boilers. A lot of these are old comp comp apartment complexes built in the 40s and 50s. So, you know, putting in more efficient energy solutions in there, whether that's for the hot water, uh, whether that's installation, you know, any of those type of things. They're trying to get their buildings LEED certified, lead or lead certified, whatever it's called. Um, so, you know, they're just high, high, leaving less of a footprint, you know, on the earth, you know what I mean? Trying to be more efficient. Makes sense. And uh, they're also trying, with that said, trying to reduce the amount of fossil fuels they use in their complexes like i said they're trying to get rid of the old boiler heat systems and all that type of stuff there so that's one of their main focuses omni new york in the bronx that is Movon to the right and that's his partner to the left i don't know where that photo is taken i'm when i talk about the bronx i'm talking about the, the wording here and what i'll be talking about that one of their newest developments that they're doing in the Bronx is a affordable housing unit, 176 unit mixed income um, a, a apartment complex. They actually devoted a percentage of these units to homeless veterans. Uh, this is going to meet multiple lead certifications for efficiency, energy efficiency. Also, we'll have a 75 
parking uh, unit parking structure on there, retail space on the bottom, and a hundred and seventy-five cameras. Okay, hundred and seventy-five camera security system. They said uh, it will actually recognize the residents' faces uh, at certain entry points in order to ensure safety um, for not only the residents but for the public also so obviously they're into technology and making sure that their residents are safe and their property is safe from the riffraff if you understand what I'm saying so that is what they're currently working on right now in the BX this is another act. It all starts with that first rental property, but I understand you may not know where to go, what information is really going to be that catalyst to help you acquire that first rental property. Well, I have the solution here for you today. Thelonious C. Jones, I'm going to be the plug for you. I want to help you out. I was able to create, as you see here on this visuals, time, freedom, accumulation of wealth, passive income in my life, but it all started with that first rental property. So I need to check out firstrentalpropertywebinar.com. This is the most comprehensive course on buying that first rental property. Go check it out right now. This is another acquisition they purchased uh, and based off what I read, 2010. This is 1,600 units. I mean, goodness gracious. 1,600 units and they paid $137 million for this. So that doesn't include the rehab, okay? That was just the purchase price. So it can tell I tell you, this dude's making major moves. None of the baby transactions, you guys. You know, let, let's let's get our mind into something a little bigger here. Because it's all possible, man. It's all possible. The reason I'm doing these presentations to tell you it's it's possible, bro. It's not it's possible, sis. You understand what I'm saying? It's not impossible, okay? So, 1,600 units purchased in the Bronx. Dude, crazy. It's like a miniature city right there, man. So, Omni America. So, there's Omni New York and then Omni America, which is a bigger uh, company that is operating in Wyoming, Massachusetts, Virginia, South Carolina, Georgia, North Carolina, and Florida. Like I said, their focus is affordable housing. They're also trying to have a social impact, you know what I mean? So trying to build the community, uh, make sure they have a, a impact on the social. I actually went to a lady who owns a nonprofit that buys multifamilies in Atlanta, and they have this way of they calculate, you know, their social impact and return on investment and all this other crazy crap. So I guess that's kind of what they're doing here, but obviously they're for profit. So you know, I much loved for the for profit hey, man. Much loved to everybody. Nonprofit, for profit. As long as you get in profit, it don't really matter. But um, that's I think what they're talking about as far as the social impact and aspect they want to have uh, in the community. And I also partner with community programs. You know what I mean? Um, so you know, just to enhance, embrace, and totally revive. Not just let's not just revive the freaking apartment and bathroom. Let's revive the community. I think that's what they're looking at. How do we, you know, rejuvenate this whole thing? Not just you know a lot of a lot of these guys. They just going in. Let's just flip it and get money and revive the unit. You know, whatever. No, no. How do we revive the community, man? It's bigger than all that little face value crap. You know what I mean? So that's that's what this brother's on. He's on some 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 bigger bigger bigger. It's bigger than me is bigger than you is bigger than us you feel me so founded in 2014 they only been around for 13 years okay and they have an ag aggregate transaction amount of 1.5 billion i don't really know what that means you don't probably know what that means but hey we can always search it that's why i put it in there so do big numbers man not no baby stuff not no fetus man big 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 stuff breaking the scale omni america getting money in multiple states um his partner his main partner is this guy eugene i'm not even gonna try to pronounce his last name we just gonna call him eugene uh he's the co-founder with my man vo movon that's them out there you know and i like i like the their pictures because they got a lot of pictures with them at their property unlike a lot of these other guys i'll be talking to you about that claim they own rental property but they ain't never took a damn picture in front of any property they own 
You know, oh, I got a portfolio. Hey, man, dude, why, why are you taking pictures in front of your car then all the time, bro? See, these do, these are real dudes, real guys, really in it, 10 toes to the concrete. Um, Gene oversees, helps oversees the 600 employees of Omni America. He was an attorney, uh, worked at another firm um, as an attorney before starting Omni with Movon and then went to Cornell University. So that's his partner in crime. This is some of the photos of some of their renovations because like I always tell you guys, people that really do this got photos of what they do on the website. People that don't really do it don't have photos on their website. It's, it's clear, man. It's clear. I'm, I'm going to just keep it honest with you. If you go to my website, udigroupllc.com, we got photos, man. We got transaction records. You go to Omni uh, New York uh, LLC.com. They got pictures, man, because they really doing this, man. So, hey, man, you guys got to watch. Hey, check them guys, man. If they ain't got a bio on their website and stuff, you need to. Hey, man, what's up, bro? You ain't got no pictures, bro. What's your transaction record, bro? Okay, look, this is Omni LLC, man. Look at this. Nice rehabs, man. Simple, but nice and clean. You know what I mean? Simple, nice, clean. You know what I mean? I like that. Look at that, man. That's the lobby, man. HowToStackYourMoney.com. Deloney and C. Jones here, real estate investor and solutionist. And I want to help you because I've been to the real estate seminars, the courses. They're great for base information, for inspiration and motivation. But when it comes to getting your money right, stacking more money up, getting more money so you can buy more real estate, I hate to say I have not found a solution in that arena, but I have a solution for you. HowToStackYourMoney.com. This platform will help you get more money stack more money so you can buy more real estate the individuals that have bought this course have seen exponential growth in the first couple months alone so check out how to stack your money.com that's the lobby man look at look at dude put the new tile up there we get the new elevators fixed dude we're changing we're changing we put the non-smoking sign up there dude we trying to change the community you understand what i'm saying we're changing the feel you know what i mean yeah you, yeah you, you give respect you get respect you understand what i'm saying this dude's really in it man he ain't really he ain't, hey man it's in him and ain't on him I'll tell you that right now some more photos right here you know what I mean? Changing out the cabinets, man. Just getting it right, man. How do we just get it right? Add value. We get it right, man. Add value. Some more photos. This is another one of his apartment complexes. I think this one is in the Bronx. Another one is apartment complex. Here goes another one. I think this one's in Brooklyn. You know what I mean? I, actually, that's the one. I think I just showed you the photo with him and his partner. I think that's where they were at. So that's another one in Brooklyn. And that's another one, dude. I mean, dude, the guy's doing it. Um, you can do it. We all can do it. But man, we gotta we gotta think bigger. We gotta get bigger, man. We gotta we gotta get on the next level, man. You know, understand what I'm saying? So, hey, man, that that's pretty much it. Let's wrap it up. If you want more info about Mo Vaughn and what he's doing, you need to go to o n y l l c dot com to check out Omni New York to learn more about him. They got press releases, more photos. They got obviously photos and a description of every property they own because they're really doing it they're not faking it you can go to movonenterprises.com that tells more about his trucking company i think they're moving like a quarter million tons of freight a year so hey man this guy's doing it he's big black real estate developers and investors with thelonious c jones thelonious c jones.com hey i appreciate you guys being on uh, 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 staying on, getting on, and uh, we come in soon with more episodes of big boss power players in the game making moves in real estate. Holla at you soon.